Welcome to our exploration of the rich and captivating world of Aztec mythology. The Aztec civilization, flourishing in Mesoamerica from the 14th to the 16th centuries, left behind a legacy of intricate myths, gods, and symbols that continue to fascinate and inspire us today. In this video, we'll journey through the top 10 Aztec mythological gods and symbols, uncovering their significance, stories, and the profound impact they had on Aztec culture and spirituality. From the fearsome gods of war to the nurturing goddesses of fertility, each deity and symbol offers a glimpse into the complex belief system of the Aztec people and their profound connection to the natural world. So, let's embark on this enchanting exploration of Aztec mythology and discover the divine beings that shaped their worldview. Number 10. Kotlikyu, the earth goddess and mother of the gods in Aztec mythology was depicted as a monstrous figure wearing a skirt made of serpents and a necklace of human hearts and hands. She symbolized the fertility of the earth and the cycle of life and death. Kotlik's terrifying appearance represented the Aztec belief in the raw power of nature, despite her fearsome image. She was revered as a protective and nurturing deity, overseeing the cycle of life and ensuring the earth's abundance. Kotlik's significance in Aztec culture highlights the interconnectedness of life, death, and renewal, echoing the cyclical rhythms of the natural world. Number 9. Zeptotec, the god of agriculture, renewal, and springtime in Aztec mythology, held a vital role in the cycle of life and rejuvenation. Often portrayed wearing the flayed skin of a sacrificial victim, Zeptotec symbolized the shedding of the old to reveal the new growth beneath. This gruesome imagery represented the renewal and regeneration of life as well as the agricultural cycles essential for the Aztec civilization's sustenance. As the patron deity of agriculture and springtime, Zyptotec was worshipped during planting seasons and fertility rites, where offerings and sacrifices were made to ensure abundant harvests. His association with renewal also extended to the spiritual realm, where believers sought his blessings for personal transformation and rebirth. Despite the unsettling nature of his depiction, Zyptotec was revered as a benevolent deity, guiding the Aztec people through the transitions of life and the ever-changing seasons. Through his symbolism of sacrifice and renewal, Zaipe Totec embodied the cyclical nature of existence and the eternal cycle of death and rebirth inherent in the natural world. Number 8. Mictlantecutli, the Aztec god of death and ruler of the underworld known as Mictlan, held a prominent place in Aztec mythology and religious beliefs. Often depicted as a skeletal figure adorned with owl feathers, Mictlantecutli symbolized the eternal cycle of life and death. As the guardian of Mictlan, he presided over the souls of the deceased, guiding them through the afterlife. In Aztec cosmology, death was viewed as an integral part of the natural order, and Mictlantecutli played a crucial role in maintaining balance and harmony in the cosmos, despite his fearsome appearance. He was not solely associated with darkness and despair. Rather, he was seen as a necessary and inevitable aspect of existence. Rituals and offerings were made to Mictlantecutli to honor the departed and ensure their safe passage to the underworld. Priests and shamans performed ceremonies to appease him and seek his protection for the souls of the deceased. Mictlantecutli's significance in Aztec culture highlights the profound reverence and respect the Aztecs held for the mysteries of death and the afterlife. His imagery and symbolism served as a reminder of the transient nature of life and the eternal cycle of rebirth and renewal. Number 7. Chalchiutlikyu, revered as the goddess of water and rivers in Aztec mythology, held a significant role in Aztec cosmology and religious practices. As the embodiment of water, she was associated with fertility, childbirth, and purification rituals essential for the Aztec civilization's well-being. Depicted wearing a skirt made of jade and holding a jar of water, Chalchiutlikyu symbolized the life-giving properties of water and its vital importance to all living beings. The Aztecs revered her as the source of rivers, lakes, and rainfall, recognizing her power to nourish the earth and sustain life. In Aztec culture, water was not only essential for physical sustenance, but also held deep spiritual significance. Chalchiutlikwe's presence in rituals and ceremonies aimed to honor and appease her, ensuring the fertility of the land, successful childbirth, and purification of the soul. Through her imagery and symbolism, Chalchiutlikyue served as a reminder of the interconnectedness of all life with the natural world. The Aztecs recognized the sacredness of water and the need to protect and respect it, acknowledging its role in sustaining life and maintaining balance in the cosmos. Number 6. 
Tonatia, the Aztec sun god, held a revered position in Aztec mythology as the embodiment of the sun's power and vitality. Depicted as a fierce warrior adorned in golden armor with a gleaming shield, Tonatia symbolized the sun's strength as it traversed the sky. His daily journey was perceived as a battle against darkness, bringing light and warmth to the world. Rituals and ceremonies dedicated to Tonatiuh honored his role in sustaining life on Earth, with offerings made to ensure his continued blessings. Through Tonatiuh's imagery and symbolism, the Aztecs celebrated the cyclical nature of existence, acknowledging the sun's essential role in the ongoing cycles of life, death, and rebirth. Number 5. Xochiquetzal the esteemed Aztec goddess of love, beauty, and fertility, held a sacred and cherished role in Aztec mythology and religious practices. Admired for her deep connection with flowers and vegetation, she embodied the vibrant abundance of nature and the perpetual cycle of life's renewal as the personification of feminine beauty, sensuality, and fertility. Xochiquetzal was honored through elaborate rituals and ceremonies. The Aztecs offered prayers and sacrifices to invoke her blessings for harmonious relationships, fruitful harvests, and the perpetuation of life itself. In Aztec art and literature, Xochiquetzal was often depicted as a radiant figure adorned with blooming flowers, exuding an aura of grace and allure. Her presence in Aztec society underscored the profound reverence for the intertwined tapestry of human emotions, natural beauty, and the perpetual rhythms of existence through her mythology. Xochiquetzal served as a poignant reminder of the intrinsic bond between humanity and the natural world, and her worship instilled a deep appreciation for the bountiful blessings of love, beauty, and fertility bestowed upon the Aztec people. Number 4. Tezcatlipoca, known as the Smoking Mirror, was a prominent deity in Aztec mythology, embodying the mysterious forces of the night sky, fate, and sorcery. Revered for his immense power and enigmatic nature, Tezcatlipoca held sway over the destinies of both gods and humans. Depicted with a smoking obsidian mirror on his chest, Tezcatlipoca symbolized insight and reflection. This mirror, believed to reveal the true nature of individuals and reflect the cosmic order, emphasized his role as a master of divination and prophecy. Tezcatlipoca's influence extended beyond mere fortune-telling. He played a vital role in the creation and maintenance of the world, representing the eternal dance between light and darkness order and chaos. As one of the four Tezcatlipocas, he embodied the night sky and its mysterious energies. Despite his association with darkness and sorcery, Tezcatlipoca also represented wisdom and transformation. He challenged mortals to confront their fears and illusions, guiding them towards self-discovery and enlightenment. Rituals dedicated to Tezcatlipoca involved elaborate ceremonies and blood sacrifices, aimed at appeasing his unpredictable nature and seeking his favor. The Aztecs believed that by honoring Tezcatlipoca, they could gain protection from misfortune and navigate the intricate web of fate. Number 3. Tlaloc, the rain god in Aztec mythology, held immense significance as a deity crucial for agriculture and the sustenance of life. Portrayed with distinctive goggle-like eyes and fangs, Tlaloc embodied the dual nature of rain, representing both its life-giving properties and its potential for destruction in the form of storms and floods. As the controller of rain and water sources, Tlaloc played a vital role in ensuring bountiful harvests and the fertility of the land. The Aztecs revered him through elaborate rituals and offerings, seeking his blessings for favorable weather conditions and protection from droughts and natural disasters. However, Tlaloc was also feared for his capacity to unleash torrents of rain and devastating storms, which could bring destruction to crops and settlements. His goggle-like eyes were believed to oversee the world watching over the land and its inhabitants, while his fangs represented the power and ferocity of thunder and lightning. Despite his formidable appearance, Tlaloc was not solely associated with destruction. He was also regarded as a benevolent deity, providing nourishment and sustenance to the earth and its people. The Aztecs recognized the delicate balance between Tlaloc's life-giving and destructive aspects, offering prayers and sacrifices to appease him and ensure his favor. Number 2. Huitzilopochtli the patron god of the Aztecs and the sun god, held a central role in Aztec religion and culture. Often depicted as a hummingbird, he symbolized agility, strength, and the sun's radiant power. As the god of war and sacrifice, Huitzilopochtli was revered for his role in protecting the Aztec people and ensuring the prosperity of their empire. He was believed to lead warriors into battle, granting them courage and victory against their enemies. 
Sacrifices and rituals dedicated to Huitzilopochtli were performed to honor him and seek his favor in times of conflict and strife. Additionally, Huitzilopochtli was associated with the sun's life-giving energy, which sustained all living beings and illuminated the world. As the sun god, he represented the source of light, warmth, and vitality, essential for the growth of crops and the flourishing of civilization. The Aztecs celebrated Huitzilopochtli through elaborate festivals and ceremonies, paying homage to his role in their society's foundation and growth. His worship was intertwined with the Aztec Empire's prosperity and expansion, as victories in war were seen as divine blessings from Huitzilopochtli. Number one, Quetzalcoatl, known as the Feathered Serpent, was one of the most significant deities in Aztec mythology, revered for his association with wind, air, and learning. As a principal deity, Quetzalcoatl held sway over various aspects of life, including knowledge, creation, and the cycles of nature. Depicted as a serpent adorned with vibrant feathers, Quetzalcoatl symbolized wisdom and the renewal of life. His imagery reflected the harmonious fusion of earthly and celestial elements, embodying the interconnectedness between the natural world and the spiritual realm. Beyond his role as a divine being, Quetzalcoatl was also revered as a cultural hero and benefactor of humanity. According to Aztec mythology, he was instrumental in the creation of humanity and the transmission of knowledge and civilization. As a patron of learning and innovation, Quetzalcoatl inspired artisans, scholars, and philosophers to pursue excellence in their respective fields. Moreover, Quetzalcoatl's influence extended to governance and societal order. He was regarded as a symbol of benevolent leadership and ethical governance embodying virtues such as compassion, justice, and enlightenment. Many Aztec rulers claimed descent from Quetzalcoatl, seeking to legitimize their authority through their perceived connection to the divine, despite his revered status. Quetzalcoatl's mythology also encompassed elements of tragedy and transformation. According to legend, he was ultimately driven into exile due to political intrigue and conflict. Yet, his departure was foretold to herald an era of spiritual renewal and the promise of his eventual return. As we conclude our exploration of the top 10 Aztec mythological gods and symbols, we're left with a profound appreciation for the depth and complexity of Aztec culture and spirituality. These divine beings and symbols were more than just characters in ancient stories. They were revered and worshipped as the embodiment of natural forces, human emotions, and cosmic phenomena through their myths and rituals. The Aztec people sought to understand the mysteries of existence, honor the cycles of life and death, and navigate the complexities of the human experience. Though the Aztec civilization may have faded into history, their myths and gods continue to captivate our imaginations and remind us of the enduring power of myth to shape our understanding of the world. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey through Aztec mythology. Until next time, may the wisdom of the gods guide your path.